the city of Panama City has big plans to renovate the landscaping of Mackenzie Park and make it a place everyone will want to visit. They'll be hosting a walkthrough at the park today at 430 to hear feedback from residents. While some residents are happy about the changes, others have some concerns. News 13's Tess Rowland spoke to some of these residents and Tess, what did they have to say? Good morning. Aaron, we spoke to some residents last week who are excited for the new changes. Others we spoke with this week have some concerns the plans could alienate the homeless population. According to the city's quality of life director, the goal of the renovations is to bring life back to Mackenzie Park. The Panama City quality of life director Sean De Palma said the project will make the space more family oriented and a better place to host events. The city is only in the design phases, so no plans are are final. According to city officials, the plan is to fix up the landscaping, plant more trees, increase the lighting, and even add a multi-use splash pad. Attorney Larry Perry says he is excited for the renovation of the park, but is also calling on city leaders to take action and deal with the growing population of homeless people in the area. Well, right now the current administration uh, wants to push away the homeless problem. They do you know, just basically ignore it. Um, they've made it themselves very clear that they do not want uh, anybody on the streets if they can help it, but they are citizens as well. And when you get to know the people out there, you find out that they've got a backstory behind them. Larry Perry says that he and his office staff have taken the time to donate food to those out on the streets. He says that some of the people he has met have passed that just might surprise you. Some are veterans. Perry even tells me that he has met one man that was a former All-American in the NFL. Perry does admit that the issue is complex and there is no magic pill type of solution, but he does tell me that changing the look of the park is not going to make the issue go away. He believes there needs to be even more emphasis on community programs that work toward making a significant difference and improve the lives of the homeless in our community. We reached out to the city for comment and have yet to hear back at this time. Aaron. 